One man is dead and another in custody after an incident in downtown Rapid City. Police say officers were called to an area off Main Street just after 3 o'clock Mountain Time this morning. Kelloland's Tyler Louder has the latest. Staff from the Cornerstone Mission stepped out for a quick break. That's when they noticed a body on the ground. He went to check on them and immediately called dispatch and the fire department, the police department responded immediately. Officers and uh, deputies from the Payton County Sheriff's Office showed up very quickly, um, did find a uh, white male, adult male, uh, on the sidewalk uh, with uh, some injuries. Uh, unfortunately, it was very quickly established that he was deceased. While this took place near the Cornerstone Mission, it did not involve anybody currently using the shelter. And it's hard for the community in general when things like this happen. So I believe that the mission is safe. Um, we have some safeguards in place for all kinds of incidences, and it's just unfortunate that this happened in the community. Police found and arrested 32-year-old Michael Flores Jr. for first-degree murder just a few hours ago. Through that investigation, the preliminary investigation anyway, we were able to come up with some uh, folks that were in the area, gave us some information that led us to a specific individual uh, who we now have. Police say Flores Jr. was out on parole for drug charges and also has a history of assaulting law enforcement. Authorities say the crime doesn't appear to be random and that there's no threat to the community. In Rapid City, Tyler Lauder, Killaland News. Authorities placed Michael Flores Jr. on a parole hold. He was then booked into the Pennington County Jail. The identity of the victim is being withheld until their family has been contacted.